Grandmother Fish, A Child's First Book of Evolution, by Jonathan Tweet, illustrated by Karen Lewis. Thanks to our backers, who made this book possible. Special thanks to Eric Meikle and the other science educators who helped us get the science right. For Tessa, my original inspiration, JT. For Kent and Sam, with love, KL. Fish. This is our grandmother, Fish. She lived a long, 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 long time ago. She could wiggle and swim fast. Can you wiggle? And she had jaws to chomp with. Can you chomp? Grandmother Fish had many kinds of grandchildren. They could wiggle and chomp. Can you find our grandmother reptile? Cousin Shark. Cousin ray -finned Fish. Cousin lobe -finned Fish. Grandmother Reptile. This is our grandmother reptile. She lived a long, 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 long time ago. She could crawl across the ground. Can you crawl? And she could breathe air in and out. Can you breathe? <sighs> Grandmother Reptile had many kinds of grandchildren. They could wiggle and chomp and crawl and breathe. Can you find our Grandmother Mammal? Cousin Bird. Cousin Lizard. Cousin Triceratops, Cousin Dimetrodon, Grandmother Mammal. Mammal. This is our Grandmother Mammal. She lived a long, long, long time ago. Her babies could squeak when they were hungry. Can you squeak? And she could cuddle with her babies and feed them milk. Can you cuddle? Grandmother Mammal had many kinds of grandchildren. They could wiggle and chomp and crawl and breathe and squeak and cuddle. Can you find our Grandmother Ape? Cousin Elephant. Cousin Carnivore. Cousin Whale. Cousin Horse. Grandmother Ape. Ape. This is our Grandmother Ape. She lived a long, long time ago. She could grab branches to climb. Can you grab? And she could hoot when she was happy. Can you hoot? Grandmother Ape had many kinds of grandchildren. They could wiggle and chomp and crawl and breathe and squeak and cuddle and grab and hoot. Can you find our grandmother human? Cousin Gibbon. Cousin Orangutan, Cousin Gorilla, Cousin Chimpanzee, Grandmother Human. Human. This is our Grandmother Human. She lived a long time ago. She could walk on two feet. Can you walk? And she could talk and tell stories. Can you talk? Grandmother Human had many kinds of grandchildren. They could wiggle and chomp and crawl and breathe and squeak and cuddle and grab and hoot and walk and talk. And I see one of them right here. Our evolutionary family tree. All life on Earth is related. This family tree traces the evolution of life on Earth. This tree focuses on the grandmothers, but the entire tree is much longer, larger. Put your finger on any point along any branch of this tree, and that spot represents a breeding population of living things. All the organisms further along that branch are the descendants of that population, including all the branches that branch off of it.
that was Grandmother Fish, A Child's First Book of Evolution by Jonathan Tweet and Karen Lewis. And this is EDU Kids Space. Subscribe for more stories, books, and lessons. And if there's something in particular you'd like to learn about, leave us a message in the comments. And you can buy this book in the description for the video.